Hi y'all. I got these today in the mail and decided to open them on camera. They've uh, been repackaged so they were a little less expensive. Um, but these are pastel paint pens and I got them to try them out to see if they would be better than the paint pens that I have. I have a few Poscas and I've got some of another brand that escapes my mind. I'll have to go look for those anyhow. But either way, I wanted some pastel colors. Let's see. I can't open this. thing I needed was not in the place that I thought it was. I don't mind paying or uh, paying. I don't, I don't mind getting an, an item that had been repackaged and saving a few bucks. These are obviously by New Top. And these are the shaking kind of markers. I made another video that may or may not be up when I put this one up. But it is acrylic paint markers that you don't have to shake. I looked into getting these earlier in the year, but I'm just now getting them. Okay. Well, you can see all the colors there. Let's take out a couple of them. Uh, they don't want to come out. Okay. So this is a uh, standard standard pin, uh, acrylic pin. I don't know how much you're supposed to shake it. I probably never shake mine long enough. Okay. Hmm. Those come out really nicely. I was really excited to... Of course, they don't have white, but uh, get these lighter shades of blue. Okay, that only took seven pumps. Cool. Now, why didn't I see that this hat didn't have a white? That's okay. I've got other white pins, but... Okay. Let's just dump them out now. It's easier. So you can put 
the lid. What do they call that post? Onto there. Okay. I don't know if I want to put them in color order. Well, now that I've started it, I've got to continue it, right? There they are. The main thing I wanted to do was to well, one of the main things to cover over lines I should probably should zoom you in a little better I guess all right cool Let's try the brown they've got another set of colors that are would be your typical colors so these are just the pastel. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, that was only six. Awesome. Well, I'm not sure I should have picked that one. Let's try this one. This one right here looks red rather than the brown of the cap. It's interesting. Okay. I like that you don't have to pump it so much to get the paint to come out. Whoa! a little bit too much. Really, I'm just using this page as a trial. Yeah, it doesn't dry fast, so I might want that to be the last. The last thing you do. 
this will be the last thing you'll do. Yeah, it's that time of night. <laughs> um, now these don't have numbers or names. So, feel free to make your own. Let's see what comes out of here. Oh, I can see it peeling up. That is just a little bit different than, oh, sorry. It's just a little bit different than that other one. So, this, this one seems to want to come out, to come out more. Well, I don't even know what I'm doing. Let's work on um, this house. It's definitely opaque enough. I think it might be a little more liquidy than my other one. These are the Artistro. These you have to shake too. I would love to have a wonderfully opaque, non-shaking paint pen, but I don't know that they're going to be able to do that. very same green. Let's look at this one is probably should have picked some that were the same color. Closer to this one. Okay. I think I shook that one already. Ugh. This one doesn't want to shake. Okay. Yeah, you don't want to pump it until it's coming out. You want to pump it until it's right up to the nib. Nib end. This one doesn't want to shake for some reason. Let's see the nib's bent too. It's not very good. I'm just wondering if after a while these other ones just don't want to look very well. See the nib's very scratchy. Okay, got that one. This isn't going to be the same green. Now when I'm shaking it, it feels like there's more liquid in there as in whatever the pigment is mixed with. Here. Um, 
these two. I guess they, whoa, they just don't last forever, you know. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't have you on the. Let's see if I can move the camera. Okay, that's better. I've had these for. I want to say, last spring. The nib's kind of wearing out. better so these might be a good replacement for the artistro ones they've been okay the artistro um, they they leaked a bit um, just like Prismas did. Okay, that's a little better now. Okay, so that one still works pretty well. Here's um Okay, you can hear the little ball rolling around in there. So if I wanted to cover this line, silvery one. Um, incidentally, the Artistro didn't have names and numbers on them either. I do like how these new top are easier to shake. The other one felt like you just had to, you know, rupture your spleen to get the thing going. I do like that light color. The flow is a lot better in these pins. So I don't suppose. that a light gray can cover over a dark um, black line very well but maybe the purple can you know if you wanted purple purple trees anyhow So comparing them to the Artistro that I had, they are easier to shake. Their flow is better, it's more consistent. Um, I, the colors are fine. I like that there's so many um, light blues, very light colors. Um, I wouldn't say this that this purple is a, particularly a pastel color. Maybe 
maybe it is um, this one. I thought I had chicken. That. This one is kind of a. Wow. So the cap doesn't mean that's what the color is. You want to look obviously at this part, which is fine. So that's that's a beautiful like powdery blue blue like that. Um, yeah, if you'd like me to do a swatch, swatch and chat of these, I can do that. Let me know in the comments. I'm just trying to compare them in this one to the ones I had, which I, you know, I've had long enough. I need to replace them. Um, and seeing how these work so well, um, I may also get their other set because it will have the white and all the other colors in it um so i like these very well all right thanks for watching